we'll guide you through how to download and install Sodium for Minecraft 1.21.5. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So Sodium has got some really great features and it's gonna go and optimize your game. So let's guide you through how you can get it. Quit Minecraft. Now what you can do is open up a web browser of your choice. What we can then do is go and type in Sodium Minecraft, just like so. Go and type in Sodium Minecraft, just like so, so we can get to the right one. And we can come to Curse Forge. This is a mod download site. And what we can then do is read through the description if you wish. Otherwise, you can press files at the top and we can then go and find it for 1.21.5. It's in beta at the moment, but that's fine. Come over to the right and we can press the three dots and press download file like so. Go and wait for it to start. Now we need to come back and we can come back to Google like so. And what we need to do is go and get Minecraft Fabric. So what we can do is go and type it in like so. Go and search for it and you can come to fabricmc.net. This is the site. At the top, you can then press a the download button and we can press download for Windows and it's now downloaded. What we're also going to need is the Fabric API as well. So go and click there. You can read through the description once again or just press files, scroll down and we can then go and find the Fabric API for 1.21.5. It's super important that the versions are the same. Come over to the right, press the three dots and press download file. It's going to shortly start downloading. We've now downloaded what we're going to need. Before we start the install process, a big shout out to the sponsors of this video, Apex Hosting. They're my go-to place for a Minecraft server. There'll be a link down below in the pinned comment and the description. So at the moment, you can get yourself 30% off your first invoice. It's definitely worth checking them out. They've got so many great features, like one click install mod packs, instant setup. One of my favorite features are the 24 seven servers and support. This means you can go and get the help anytime you need it, there's a problem or anything like that. Now to start the install process. So what we need to do is go and head to our downloads. You can right click on your file explorer and press downloads and here we are. What we can then do is just go and select these and drag them onto our desktop. The first thing we need to do is go and run the Fabric Installer. So we can go and double click on it like so. What's super key is we select the correct Minecraft version, which is 1.21.5 in our case, and we can then press install, and it's now been successfully installed. So you can then press OK there. And now what we need to do is go to the mods folder. So go and open up the Minecraft launcher. This shouldn't take too long. At the top, you can press installations and we then need to go and scroll down and we can find Fabric Loader 1.21.5 and press the folder icon to the right when you're hovering over it. Then you can scroll down and go and find the mod folder. If you don't have one here, you can right click in some blank space, hover over folder and create one called mods, but you should be there. Double click on it. And then what we need to do is go and drag and drop the API and sodium in. So I'll go and drag sodium and then the API. You can then close the folder. Now hover over Fabric Loader and you can press play to the right and Fabric and Minecraft are going to launch. If I go and pause the game, come to options and then video settings, you'll go and notice these go and look different and that is because we've got Sodium installed. So hopefully you'll go and find you get an increase in your performance in Minecraft as well. 